Hi, this is Tom Sachdeva selling condos in Toronto and today I'm here with, with Jazz. And Jazz, what are we discussing about today? Well, we're going to discuss the 50 town center court condos called Encore by Monarch at Scriber Town Center. So give me the basics of the building first. Mm, well, it's a 39 story building, just recently built uh, 2013. Uh, the most modern building at Scarborough Town Centre. So there are 11 units per level and which consists of a, a couple studio units, a one bedroom unit, one bedroom plus 10 units, two, one two bedroom, two washroom unit and one two bedroom and a solarium unit. So just what is a studio unit? Well, the studio units usually don't have a bedroom. Well, they don't have a bedroom and uh, so it's open concept uh, living space and uh, so studio units in this building there's two types one is 323 square foot the other one is 327 square foot and the only difference is really one has a stand-up shower in the bathroom and the other one doesn't do they come with parking no studio units do not come with the parking and they do not come with the locker either unless the homeowner bought that so which are the most popular units in the building? Well, most popular units in this building are the one bedroom plus 10. So there's six one bedroom plus 10 units per floor and the two bedroom and two washroom southwest corner uh, in, the, in the building. So the one bedroom and a den units west and south facing uh, are the best layouts? Yeah, the O3 layout and the O2 layout is by far the best uh, in the building. The O2 is a two bedroom and two washroom unit, and the O3 is a one bedroom plus den, and the den is very usable for to create put an office in. Are the dens big enough to be a second bedroom? No, the dens are not uh, because they're not closed. Unlike in other condos where there's an actual door to them, these dens are open concept. So they're wide open. So it could be used as a uh, an office or a baby's room. Yeah, you you could uh, you know potentially use this in some of them. You could use them as a baby's room, uh, but most of the time you would use it as a desk uh, office area. As what are the amenities available at Fifty Town Center Court? So the amenities at Fifty Town Center includes a theater right on the main level. Uh, there's also a party room, fitness room, sports lounge with billiards, and also two guest suites. So is a swimming pool missing? Uh, there is no swimming pool in this building. However, uh, there is a YMCA right across the street. So basically two minute walk and uh, it has a pool, gym and everything that you would need. Uh, the YMCA complements any amenities that you might require. Jess, how much is the maintenance cost? And what is included? And the maintenance cost uh, is on average about 60 cents a square foot and that includes a parking and a locker and uh, also it includes your heating and water but it does not include your hydro so you pay your hydro as you go. Yes, which is the most popular floor plan available at Encore at, at Equinox? Well, the most popular floor plan at uh, 50 Town Center Encore is a two bedroom and the two washroom, a southwest corner. This unit sold out very quickly at pre-construction phase. They are 825 square foot and they're, the reason why they're the most popular is because they have the south view and the west sunset view and unobstructed view both ways and uh, towards the CN Tower, Sunset, and uh, Bendale community at the south towards the lake. So you could see all of that, especially on higher levels. And they've got large windows, floor to ceiling windows almost, in the living, dining rooms. And the bedrooms are separated. So overall, as a layout for a two bedroom, two washroom, you know, the space is being very well used. And the other unit is a one bedroom plus 10, the O3 west facing, uh, 650 something square foot. They're very popular as well, because once again, unobstructed views and you get the west uh, sunset view as, as well. So which are the, the least demand of, uh, layout for the floor plan? 
Well, the units that took longest to sell was the two bedroom and solarium units on the southeast corner. Primarily because, uh, you know, quite frankly, the uh, layout isn't the best. Uh, there's a lot of wasted space in the hallway and the bedrooms are side by side. Solarium could have been uh, part of the family room to give it a more open feel and concept instead of okay. cut out. And more additionally, because uh, you're facing the central condos, so that your east view is practically blocked by the central condos, and you only really have a south view from the kitchen. So that was the most unpopular uh, unit yeah. layout. Would you recommend uh, an investor to buy a unit in this building? Absolutely, the best units for an investor is probably a studio. Uh, you know, they, they could be around one hundred eighty thousand dollars up to, and but you're getting you know, close to a thousand dollars rent too, and uh, the lowest maintenance fee possible, because you don't have a parking, you don't have a locker to worry about. Uh, is it a pet friendly building? It is a pet friendly building, as most condos are, and you can keep a small dog or small cat in in, in the building. Just what are the top three? features of this building? Location, location, and location. <laughs> That's pretty much it. You're right at Scarborough Town Center. It's a brand new building, pretty much. Uh, all the amenities are nearby. Fresh goes there, uh, walking distance to Scarborough RT Station uh, and the Scarborough Town Center. So really, it's all about location and having the modern amenities, your granite counters, uh, some, most, some of the units have stainless steel appliances, M many have black appliances, but you know, brand new laminate floorings. So it's, it's just a modern building. Jess, you've spoken on pluses about the building. So what is the transit score and the walk score for this building? Uh, for 50 Town Center, the walk score is 87, transit score is 97. So as you could see, it's very walkable. One minute to walk to Scarborough RT Station, Scarborough Town Center. You, there's also Macauan RT Station right there, YMCA right there. Uh, fresh go, a couple minutes to walk to, and uh, you got the wooded lots, uh, dog park nearby. And also this uh, skating rink is right there at Civic Center. Uh, so you got the parks, you got the restaurants, you got the, the theater. Uh, anything you need to do and want to do, it's all within minutes. And you don't need to have a car to no. carry all those. You, you don't need a car to do anything, basically. It's, it's all available right there. Just what are the schools for this building? The primary school is St. Andrews Public School or North Bendale Public School. High school is David and Mary Thompson Collegiate or technical is school is Bendale. And the University of Toronto is nearby, the Scarborough Campus, Centennial College Scarborough Campus is nearby. And also there's a Canadian Business College nearby as well. Yes. How are the north, south, east, west views of this building? Ooh, that's a tough one. That's Well, it's not a tough one, but it's very important when you buy a condo at this building to know that. Uh, the south view is unobstructed, the best views. So there are, you know, one bedroom plus 10 units, a couple of them, and uh, two bedroom plus two washroom unit and a two bedroom and a solarium unit that faces the south. The west view is also unobstructed. Uh, the northwest corner uh, view, unfortunately, is towards uh, UQ1 at 50 Town Center, I mean 60 Town Center. And uh, the north view is at, you know, blocked, most of it is blocked by 70 Town Center, UQ2. And East View is blocked by Central Condos at uh, uh, one at 25 Town Center. Jess, how would you rank this building on a scale of one to ten at Scarborough Town Center? Overall, I give it about eight point five to nine, uh, primarily because it location is top notch location. Uh, it has modern amenities and finishes. The only thing it lacks is really a pool and maybe some of the other gymnasium stuff that if you want to play badminton or so. But you, you got the YMCA right across the street. But uh, price-wise, it is a little bit more expensive than uh, some of the other condos, but you pay for what you get. Being a newer building. 
newer buildings with modern finishes in your unit. If you want to see more properties for sale, the condos for sale, click on that link below the video. Subscribe right here so that every week you can see new condos, get introduced to the new condos. And don't forget, visit our website. Call us when you're ready. We always there. Call Tom Jazz to buy and sell.